Hello and thanks for joining us on TVC News this hour. We begin in Abuja, where President Bola Tinubu has launched the Renewed Hope Conditional Cash Transfer Scale-Up Scheme, which is targeted as giving cash to the poor and vulnerable who have been captured on the social register and their identity verified. The launch of this conditional cash transfer was done by the Secretary to the Government of the Federation, George Akume, on behalf of President Tinubu. TVC News State House correspondent Femi Akwandi reports. The International Day for the Eradication of Poverty is commemorated with the launch of the Renewed Hope Conditional Cash Transfer Scale-Up that will benefit about 61 million Nigerians. <laughs> President Bola Tinubu's administration officially commenced the disbursement of 25,000 naira each to 15 million households for the next three months. Minister of Humanitarian Affairs and Poverty Alleviation has committed to ensuring this conditional cash transfer directly gets to the poor. 15 million households will be receiving 75,000 naira over a space of three months. This equates to about 61 million Nigerians directly. President Tinubu says this cash transfer is an immediate intervention to cushion the effect of fuel subsidy removal. There are already plans to expand the social register and capture Nigerians living below the poverty line, which, according to the World Bank, 71 million Nigerians are extremely poor. The government is working to develop and deploy several more solutions and interventions to help Nigerians of all works of life. This includes a investment of 100 billion to purchase 3,000 units or 20 seater compressed natural gas powered buses. In this particular case, the audit trail is there. The mechanism that is going to be used is one that is biometric. It is proven you will be able to name every single person that has received those funds. Nigeria's development partners are optimistic that this cash transfer scheme is well intended and will relieve pains caused by the removal of your subsidy. You know, it's understandable that taking such a move would require real political courage. And His Excellency the President was willing to take that. And that's where the renewed hope in terms of a better future for Nigeria, it starts there because otherwise the government would not be able to afford the many services, what it owes to the Nigerian people. Hopefully, the scale-up of the renewed hope conditional cash transfer will lift millions of Nigerians out of poverty. As the federal government says, in the coming days, there will be a rollout of more plans and programs targeted at improving the fortunes of the poor and vulnerable in the country. Femi Akonde, TVC News, Abuja.